congregation of his people. Jesus is our living hope. Amen. Yes. Yes. As we look to him this morning for every need, our every need, big or small, physical, emotional, financial, we just have to keep our eyes on Jesus. Amen. Yes. Amen. So I just want to encourage us, those of us who have a need, just look to the Lord right now. Just raise your hand up. Just raise your hand up to the Lord. And it's not Ben that you look to, but Jesus. Jesus. Lord, Father God, we just lift our eyes to you. We lift our hearts to you. We lift our hands to you, God. We are nothing, but you are everything, God, because you gave everything to set us free, to heal us, to meet us at our point of need. Father God, we just want to put our hope in you. We put our hope in you, our living hope. Father, when, when the world says that it's no hope, we can trust in you, God, because you're alive. Father, and you're alive now, right here, here in our midst, oh Father. So we just lay all our burdens at your feet right now. We just lay our problems, our sicknesses, oh Father. We just lay all at your feet. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Lord. Just let the Lord just come and minister to our hearts. Hallelujah. And just receive, receive from the Lord. His presence is here. The Lord wants to come and touch us in a very personal way this morning. Hallelujah. Lord, we just fix our eyes on Jesus, the author and the perfecter of our faith. Hallelujah. There's no one like you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, this morning we want to remember also Sister Lena all in the family, even as they um, grieve on the loss of her father, Lord. We just want to commit the family to you. Be with them. Be close to them. Comfort them, Lord. And Father, we just pray that you continue to just lead and be amongst us this day in service. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. He just remain. Give the Lord a big clap. Hallelujah. In the new chapter 24, verse 6 and 7, say, He is not here. He is risen. Remember how he told you while he was still with you in Galilee. The Son of Man must be delivered over to the hands of sinners, be crucified, and on the third day be raised again. Hallelujah. That is the risen Savior we worship today. Amen. Let's pray together. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we thank you for the gift of your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, who came and died for our sins to bring us forgiveness we praise you for the glorious resurrection that has redeemed every human of our power of grace. May you continually carry hearts of faithfulness within us for this great hope that we have in Christ. Give us the knowledge of his continual presence that we may be strengthened and sustained by his risen life. Grant us the grace to continually grow in holiness to deny ourselves and take up our cross and follow him all the days of our lives. We give our hearts and surrender our all to Jesus our Savior. Let his heart be our heart forevermore. Bless us with the strength to carry this good news of hope and salvation to the world of glory 